and often as they race away here and uh, a levelish start rocks home Annie on the inside those uh, goes up to lead from two in second black bolero are these uh, as that switches to the outside, comes four, Droopies and Nadine, who's trying to move through on the inside. Six, Swantalona Diva now makes a move as well. Coming around the second last bend, and Swantalona Diva goes past to trap one, rocks home Annie in a bit of a hurry there. Then comes four, Droopies and Nadine, as they come around the final bend, and Swantalona Diva will win for Kevin Hutton. It's been a good night for Kevin, and uh, she wins by a street in the end. Four, Troopies Nadine in second and one. Rocks home Annie in third. Well, I didn't know a lot about Swansalona Diva, but I do now. I think, you know, looks a very, very nice pup. Odell Faith, I remember, being a pretty decent open racer herself. And, uh, and you know, that was impressive, wasn't it? Yeah, very impressive. Didn't fly away and that had to run, a, run around dogs around the bend and that, but showed a great bit of pace down the back straight and, you know, just... Again, I don't think it was the strongest race in the world, but uh, uh, she can only go on from there. Yeah, well, Kevin Hutton, of course, was our guest in the studio yesterday. He's had three winners on the next day, and I'm sure Seamus wouldn't mind three winners at Wimbledon tomorrow night. Yeah, we settled for that. Uh, well, even to get three through tomorrow night would be lovely and, uh, you know, maybe win one down the line. Well, Swansalona Diva is certainly a greyhound to keep on the right side of. The daughter of College Causeway winning here. And winning well. Picked off an A1 earlier in the year and now opens her account here at Hove, her open race account. OK, that's uh, Swansalona Diva winning and winning well from four and one. We've got, uh, of course... Uh